Good morning everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Laura and this is day three of our um, trip to Newport Bath and Newport City. Um, we just got back from breakfast which was really nice. I'm really full and we're going to head to the car later because we have to check out obviously it's our last day here. I don't know what the plans are exactly for today but I'll just take you along anyway. <laughs> Let's go. Molly doesn't want to leave. <laughs> Hello, Molly. Hello. Good morning. <laughs> she's really comfy here in our in our bed. She's not supposed to be on the bed, but she keeps on sneaking up. And since it's our last day, anyways, it's okay. This morning, after I woke up, she went to literally lie on top of my um, pillow. Such a spoiled little girl, right? Yeah. <laughs> Um, what I quickly still wanted to talk to you about is actually kind of like Belgium's weather really quickly as you can see the grass in front of us and the dunes in the distance they are all very yellow and dry and this is not at all what it's supposed to look like the um, grass and everything uh, here in Belgium is not supposed to look like that usually Belgium has a pretty wet climate uh, even in summer in summer there's a little bit less rain than the rest of the year but it's still pretty um, rainy grass is green everything's really beautiful but um, this year we have an unprecedented drought cattle doesn't have enough grass to feed on um, farmers have trouble with their crops the river levels are super low and um, yeah even though we haven't been having that high temperatures like we have had a couple of really hot days but more or less it's just a drought it doesn't rain even today uh, it was supposed to rain rainy weather was forecasted but it hasn't rained at all and it's very sunny at the moment um, and next week too uh, they are predicting that there's going to be some more warm temperatures and sunny days so no rain again hopefully later this month um, some rain will finally come because otherwise it's going to be really really bad for the grass and all of the other plants yeah just now mom was, no not mom molly was <laughs> <laughs> I was like crying because I was standing too far away. What, meisje? Yeah, Molly. Molly, you play? Yeah. Hello. <laughs> mom, mom, was Molly crying? <laughs> We're going to um, look around a bit more here in Newport Bath and then around 3 o'clock in the afternoon we'll be heading home because it's a long trip back and we want to avoid any um, traffic jams. Okay guys, I got another little souvenir or present for Lien at Tommy Hilfiger in Belgium. They give a lot of us, uh, they have a lot of sales going on in um, July and even in August they do even bigger sales even though the new collections are already coming in. So I got Lien a very beautiful sweater. I hope you guys can actually hear me because there's a lot of wind today. The yellow flag is uh, flying, which means you can only swim, no boats or um, like surfing stuff allowed in the ocean, in the sea. I just wanted to come out to the beach really quickly again, even though I have like my shopping bag and my regular shoes on because it's just something I enjoy so thoroughly, like just the wind. The smell, I can hear the, um, ah, come on, what are, are those? The seagulls just, I don't know what that's called, like crying. It's amazing. I love it so much. And it is um, August. It's the beginning of August, so you think it's super hot. It's only 20 degrees, so I'm in the sweater. Crazy, right? But uh, it's very, very nice. Let's go back to mom. Mommy! Mommy! 
Molly's already waiting for me. Hi Molly! Pas trop fière, hein? Dag meisje! Dag meisje! Hey? What was Molly doing? Was she crying again? Molly! I'm back! Molly! And go to the orthodox. <laughs> I just tried this um, kind of vest on because I really like the color and it's soft but I don't like the way it fits me it has some shoulder pads in here and it makes me look very broad it's like too puffy so this is a no unfortunately okay guys we are now back uh, closer to the hotel and I ordered some nice warm Earl Grey tea mom has got a coffee right? <laughs> coffee we got some snacks and i also got some uh, tomato soup it's quite chilly at the moment so this is going to be very nice something really bad just happened unfortunately i either lost my bag with rings present or it got stolen when we were giving molly some water we've been looking everywhere going back to each store we visited and even went back to tommy hilfiger to ask if somebody brought something back uh, they nobody had left anything so we just um left our phone number left our name and what we bought uh, which size and around what time so hopefully somebody still brings it back but it's looking like it's gone unfortunately I was really really upset earlier but at the moment there's nothing we can what I was saying before yeah it seems like it's gone and there's nothing we can do uh, except for wait maybe somebody brings it back but um, we're in Belgium we're not in Japan so that chance is quite uh, slim um, yeah I was quite upset earlier about it but there's nothing much we can do except for wait and yeah just hope for the best if Nobody, if we don't get a phone call, I'm just going to order it one more time on their website because we bought the last S size uh, at the store. Yeah, that was really, really not fun. Um, yeah, I'm still upset a little bit about it, but I'm just going to enjoy my tea now and the soup when it comes. Uh, yeah, and still try to enjoy the rest of the day. I have a little update for you all about the um, sweater that I lost or maybe got stolen. After checking all of my video footage from that day, we uh, were able to conclude that it had indeed been stolen. It was not like I uh, lost it. After giving Molly some water, we stood up and the place where we put our bags, there was one bag missing. Um, somebody in passing by uh, probably... Um, picked it up and went away with it it's very very unfortunate i think i got a little bit too used to being in japan where such things rarely if ever happen and if you leave something something for a little while somewhere then uh, it's just still there when you go to check if it's still there yeah it's unfortunate but it's okay a lesson learned <laughs> 